The Longaberger Company was an American manufacturer and distributor of handcrafted maple wood baskets and other home and lifestyle products. It was one of the primary employers in the area near Dresden, Ohio, with more than 8,200 employees and $1 billion in sales. Started in Dresden, the company's last location was in Newark, Ohio. A family-owned and operated business, the Longaberger Company was started by Dave Longaberger in 1973. Longaberger used multi-level marketing to sell products. The company had approximately 45,000 independent distributors called home consultants in the United States who sold Longaberger products directly to customers. A combination of a recession and changing tastes in home decor combined to send sales, which peaked in 2000 at $1 billion, to about $100 million in 2012. The company was taken over in 2013 by CVSL, Inc. In May 2015, Tami Longaberger, who had led the company since her father died in 1999, resigned as Chief Executive Officer and Director of the company. As of April 2016, there were fewer than 75 full-time and part-time employees, approximately 30 of those still made baskets. On May 4, 2018, a note was sent out from a sales force supervisor that the company had ceased operations. The old Longaberger corporate headquarters on State Route 16 is a local landmark and a well known example of novelty architecture, since it takes the shape of the company's biggest seller, the medium market basket. The seven-story, 180,000-square-foot building was designed by the Longaberger Company, and executed by NBBJ and Corder Namath Engineering. The building opened in 1997. The basket handles weigh almost 150 tons and can be heated during cold weather to prevent ice damage. Originally, Dave Longaberger wanted all of the Longaberger buildings to be shaped like baskets, but only the headquarters was completed at the time of his death. The company stopped paying property taxes on the building at the end of 2014, and, as of July 2016, intended to relocate all remaining employees to offices in nearby Frasiesburg. topic history In 1919 JW Longaberger accepted an apprenticeship with the Dresden Basket Factory Although the Dresden Basket Factory closed as a result of the Great Depression he still made baskets on the weekends he and his wife Bonnie Jean Longaberger gist eventually raised enough money to purchase the closed basket factory and start a business of their own. One of J.W. and Bonnie's children, Dave, opened J.W.'s handwoven baskets in 1973. Starting in 1978, the company began selling Longaberger baskets through home shows using a multi-level marketing model. Each basket is handmade, signed and dated by the maker. It was announced in February 2016 that the basket building would be closed and remaining employees would relocate to Longaberger's manufacturing plant in Fraserburg, Ohio. In December 2017, the building was purchased by Steve Kuhn, a Canton, Ohio-based developer who owns Kuhn Restoration, and his partner, Bobby George of Cleveland. By November 2018 the pair had put it up for sale. <laughs> 